Number 61, letter A. What is the unknown EMF sub X in a potentiometer that balances when R sub X is 10 ohms and balances when R sub S is 15 ohms for a standard 3 volt EMF? So we, uh, we have this formula, all right? They're connected in series, so we have that uh, V sub S over R sub S will equal V sub X over R, uh, R sub X. Now, we're solving for the V sub X, basically, which is the EMF, right? They're both measured in voltage, so we know that's what we have to solve for. So this is how you just do it. You just do a little cross multiplication. Now we realize that the V sub X is what we're looking for. We gotta know these three variables, right? And these two are multiplied together in the numerator. So R sub X they told us was 10, V sub S the standard cell EMF that is, is three, and the R sub S they told us is 15. So it's just a simple plug in. So it's 30 over 15, obviously that's two, right? So 2.00, I guess, volts, all right? That takes care of that. That's letter A, and letter B, uh, the same, this same EF, uh, EMFX is placed in the same potentiometer, which now balances when R sub S is 15, standard cell is uh, 3.1, and what resists R sub X? So it's the same problem, right? Just we're solving uh, for a different variable. So this is uh, V sub S over R sub S is equal to V sub X over R sub X. We're solving for now R sub X, so Cross multiply that on out, cross multiply this on away, and cross multiply this on up, and look at that. Boom, there's the formula. So R sub X is equal to V sub X, which they told us now is the one that we're gonna use from the prior problem, so two, multiplied by R sub S, they said that that's 15, divided down by 3.1, which is the standard voltage, and this one I'll just plug into the calculator to double check, It'd be a little less than two, so two times 15 divided by 3.1, so it comes out, what am I talking about, too? I mean, <laughs> wow. Okay, well, that's what happens when you're doing this at a, what time is it? Yeah, 12.47 at night. Um, okay, so this is now 9.9, that's why I use the calculator sometimes, 9.68, all right, uh, ohms. There you go. All right, guys, thank you so much for tuning in. Hopefully that helped, and I will see you in the next problem. Take care.